John Candy's Darling Life. Hello there, my darlings. Oh, sorry for the, the bumping, the shaking. I guess maybe I should hold it like this. Um, so anyways, today is a Tuesday, Tuesday um, afternoon, and we're headed to Ottawa. <laughs> yep, we're going to Ottawa to the Anne series screening, and I'm so looking forward to it. I hope it all goes well, and I hope to bring all of you along, hopefully, to see what we can do. And so yeah, so we're just on our way now, and I don't know if you can see inside the, there, it's pouring, pouring rain. <laughs> so, it's kind of nasty. But uh, anyways, we're on our way to Ottawa to see the Anne series screening. So I'm just back. I just wanted to say for those of you who didn't watch my exciting news video um, that I did and telling about um, where we're going to uh, see the Anne screening in Ottawa, I was invited. Um, I'm uh, on Facebook. I'm on their um, Anne series uh, page there. And I got a thing in the, um, in the mail or whatever like in my mailbox saying that I was invited to go and um, so I just wanted to quickly tell you so at 6 it's 6 p.m. the doors open and then 7 o'clock opening remarks and and screening and then at 8 15 the panel discusses uh, feature uh, there's a panel discussion sorry and it features the cast and creators of Anne and then at 9 p.m. there's a reception and there will be three actors there um, Anne, of course, Marilla and Matthew, and those actors' names are, um, the girl that plays Anne is Amy Beth McNulty, I think, R.H. Thompson playing Matthew, and, uh, uh, Geraldine James playing Marilla. So, and it's, we're going to Ottawa, like I said, and it's at the National Arts Centre. So, yay! I hope you guys can see me. I don't know if you saw any of this or not, but that is what we're doing. And I'm just dressed. Um, I'm just wearing this dress that you've seen me in before and my, one of my favorite earrings kind of thing. And I did my nails sort of, <laughs> and I'm wearing one of my favorite rings as well. So, yay. <laughs> Recalculating. Continue 130 meters, then turn right on Elgin Street. See how busy it is? We're in Ottawa now. Crazy. Bumper to bumper. Apparently that's the National Arts Center. Looks a little bit rough. I don't know. I could be wrong. We're in, still in traffic. It is. It, they're doing renovations. Looks like it, it's well needed. Half an hour. Big deal. They we're in the parking lot, finally. Lost satellite reception. Give me that. National. I don't know if you guys can see that through our dirty window. Now. Where do you go? Oh. Fastener drop off. We just went straight. So here we are, my darlings. We're here at the Ann Netflix CBC screening. There she is. So darling. And as you can come over here. They got another poster there, and we look at these awesome chairs here. Those are so cool. And then there's the. I think they're going to be getting pictures here. Twenty picture taken. Pictures. Oh, and up there's the screen. And there's the little gate. That is so neat. I love that backdrop. Flowers from ice. Sorry, I was trying to keep it steady. 
And then this is uh, the chairs again back there. It's so cool. Can you hold, can you film? This one is. I can't believe we're here at the end screening. This is so exciting, my darlings. And I can't wait to bring you. I hopefully we'll be able to film some more. I don't know. We've just signed in. And um, we have a pretty big venue here. And that's going to be the backdrop, I guess, where they're going to um, take some pictures and whatnot. So I'm just so excited. So awesome. Hmm? Still filming. Here they are. And there's there's RH right there. There she is. Oh my gosh, my darling, there she is. And there's Merlin. There's, um, there's the lady that's playing Lynn, right here. There they go. There's the whole theater. Look. Wow. Awesome as a ball. Seated territory of the Algonquin Nation, Miigwech. And I would also like to acknowledge the presence of my youngest daughter this evening, Juliette, who is turning six today. Aww. And who thought it was pretty cool to leave school a couple of hours early in Montreal, jump on a train for the first time of her life, thank you, Via. <laughs> and be my date. Oh, <laughs> Aww, it's so nice. So Canadians fell in love with Anne on CBC television this spring. Now millions, millions of new fans around the world will be able to experience the story through Netflix. And I think that you'll agree with me that Prince Edward Island itself became a character in this series and looked really beautiful. Let me tell you that we would not, we wouldn't be here tonight without Maura Wally Beckett and Miranda Despensier, who had a vision of what Anne's story could mean to audiences in 2017. We're also very fortunate to have some of the cast and crew here tonight. L'incomparable Ami Beth Beckett. Geraldine James. Woo! R. H. Thompson. Woo! Lucas J. Zuman. Colleen Coslo. Alan Schaefer and Jenna McMillan. After the screening, Amy Bett, Geraldine, R.H., the producers, and our programming people from CBC and Netflix will join journalist Joanna Schneller on stage for a discussion about what it was like to make this show. And following that, we hope that you'll join us for a Haiti inspired reception just outside of this theater in the main foyer. Welcome James, who plays Royal Cuthbert, and Alex Thompson, who is Matthew Cuthbert. Beckett, 
Pitt, the writer, showrunner, and executive producer of Adam. I got you some extra food there. There's oh, look at Rob brought me. Where'd there's you get that? At the door when you come in, you gotta, if it gets too too big, you turn the wire and it tightens apparently. Oh. You want that or yeah, not? Yeah, put it on my head. I bought some extra food for you. Look, so Rob got me a flower crown. We've had such a great time. It's awesome. We uh, great food. And the library almost always wish you guys were all here. It's been a good night. It has. And to end the evening, I was going to show you this really peaceful, but not so peaceful now, <laughs> that really neat fountain here at the National Art Center in Ottawa. 
goes way up there. Wonderful evening. Had a wonderful time.